Thank you. Thank you, Mal, for that alert. Mild is a good mod. And welcome to my humble abode. This is my office. Where I do office things. This is my bed. This is my dungeon. This is the HGTV DLC. If you can tell. Yeah, yeah. This is the Simpsons house. Look at this. This is clear, so very clearly the Simpsons house. 742 Evergreen Terrace. Isn't that neat? <laughs> the cars even crashed through the garage door. It's amazing. Big Sims vibes, definitely, yeah. Welcome to your first job in Sunset Bay. Are you ready to help John and Nicole renovate the house of their dreams? While the house is small, the view is amazing. You will have to make some decisions when it comes to room arrangements. The shack under the house is especially problematic. Okay, so we need to mind the shack and be wary of the view. All right. What should you do about that room? Okay, so she wants a sauna and a bathroom. Being able to hop in the sauna after swimming in the sea sounds fantastic to her. But he says, just cleaning it up will suffice. This is a very capable storage room, maybe even suitable for a workshop. It could do with a chair though. Now hey, thanks for the follow wave kid. Hope you enjoy your stay. Now obviously his choice is cheaper, but her choice, like her choice seems to be the, the better one, obviously. Although his choice is much, much cheaper. Alright, we're gonna go with her.
what do you want? This living room is definitely missing something. Definitely a TV, the room feels so empty without it. We can also add some decorations, a carpet and a few potted plants. Okay. And he says, a fireplace could make this room feel more complete. A large corner electric fireplace would introduce a modern touch to the interior and make evenings more pleasant. I'm thinking fireplace. I'm thinking fireplace. Whichever option is cheaper. I think fireplace is cheaper because she wants the TV, then she also wants decorations and the carpet and the plants. And the TV is already expensive enough. Maybe, just maybe, we go with him on this one. That's what I'm thinking. We go on him on the, with him on this one. Let's do this. There we go. Much better. Let's complete this job. We're going to complete the job for 7,000 euros. Which is not a lot. Photographing apartment. Let's take a look. This is the before. And this is the after. How lovely is that? We turned this into a bathroom. And the storeroom was transformed into a lovely, cozy sauna. I didn't do anything to the bedroom. Don't know why they're showing it. And the uh, sky changed a little bit. All thanks to me, of course. And we're saving our files in our portfolio. Job, 100 year old memories. This house is over 100 years old and the ubiqui ubiquitous wood gives it a unique appeal. It will be great for Trevor and Lily and their kids, a family of sailors. The family fell in love with the house at first sight. It was not cheap, so the budget for its renovation is limited. It should be just enough to have it refreshed and to introduce some necessary changes. Okay, so we're on a very tight budget here. We're on a 2000... <laughs> okay, boomer house. We have two choices, 11 room. 11 rooms? No wonder it was expensive. 11 rooms?
Okay, we have a decision to make here. Let's remove the fluorescent lights in the mirror from the abo from above the sink so we can lay elegant wall tiles in my new mirror by the fridge. It will optically enlarge the interior and make it prettier. The mirror fits and looks like a window. Let's keep it. We'll just buy a few more lamps to keep the place brighter. I say we I, I say. I say we buy a few more lamps because it's cheaper. They're on a budget, you know. And I just I don't want to break their budget. How wonderful is that? Let's take a look at the before and after. We had this mess and we stylized it into a blue and white themed bedroom. We cleaned up this whole room, put in a big ass sofa. Yeah, down there by the fireplace. The bathroom was also cleaned out. Stayed within budget. We fixed the fuse box and cleaned up the, the storeroom. This bedroom was a mess, but it's been restored as was this one the whole outside of the house has been returned to its blue hue and it's now move-in ready how wonderful is that only one half May works in property renovation and the rental business and she's expecting a baby so there's no way she can work as much as usually someone has to help her with a house for one of her clients. Fortunately, the house doesn't need a major makeover as it underwent renovation not so long ago. The client has two dogs that are treated as part of the family. If the budget is high enough, we'll add some additional accessories for the pups. You're damn right we're gonna add accessories for the pups. I'm gonna make everything the cheapest option so we can add accessories for the doggos. I'm just gonna see what the decision is. 
Maybe we should demolish the two walls and connect the living room, dining room, and kitchen together. Shall we do it? No, let's, let's knock them down. What do you think? I think we knock them down. Knock it all down. Screw it. Okay, someone started working on the kitchen already, going with dark brown paint. Are we thinking dark? <laughs> Smiley face. I know what you meant to do, so. <laughs> uh. We're going to go dark.
going to finish the job. We're going to take a look at the before and after pictures, and then we're going to wrap up the stream slash recording if you're watching this on YouTube. Well, we made 10,000 on that. Nice. Oh, look at that. Look at that genius work from me. I'm great. Look, it's amazing. It actually looks real good. We've cleaned up this entire area, made it a nice dark modern kitchen. The bathroom has been expanded with a shower off to the side. The garage has been cleaned out completely. We've done amazingly. Yes, also this sound. Right, I'm gonna wrap up the stream. Thank you guys so much for chilling here. It's been great, it's been fun, it's been cool, it's been good. Uh, if you enjoyed it, uh, in on YouTube now, to the YouTube people. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Let me know something in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in whatever I upload next. Now I'm not recording. Let's, let's shit on YouTube.